Hey guys. Welcome back for another Dollar Tree haul. My hair is getting so long. If I don't have a hairstyle, as usual, I was going to leave it down because I kind of have a headache, but I don't know. I don't know if I can handle it down. So I'm just going to pull it up real quick. So yeah, I stopped in Dollar Tree the other day. What the heck was I going there for? I forget. I went there just for like a couple of things and I ended up with just two little bags of stuff. Here, let me just get my little ponytail going. Half ponytail. Okay, that's better. So I picked up a few things. And yeah, let's just get started. So the first thing I picked up were these sweet and salty bugles, the churro flavor. I have never seen these. So they're cinnamon sugar flavored, like churros. Like what? Where have I been? I've never, no, I've never. It says that there's caramel ones too, like on the back of the bag. Like seriously? But yeah, churro flavored cinnamon sugar. I think last year they had for like a limited time, they had the Cheetos, but they were like cinnamon sugar. Maybe that was a year before. I don't know. It's been a while. But yeah, I'm excited for all of us to try those. Next, I've seen people, like, haul these little cell phone holders so many times and for so long. It's like, what the heck? My store is never going to get those. And I was walking through, like, up at the register. That's where all the good stuff is, up at the register. Um, Pretty and, what is it? Pretty and Flawed? Is that her channel? Oh, my God. I just totally forgot. I think that's what it is. She, like, her one Dollar Tree she went to had, like, a whole aisle that's, like, all the good stuff that's usually up at the register. So, you don't have to, like, go through and search for it. It's, like, all the cute, good, like, this type of stuff. Just the random stuff. And they were all in one spot. But, anyway, up at the register they had this one. It has a unicorn horn and a little heart. And it's, like, okay, that's a sign that Adrian needs to have that for her phone. So, yeah, you it's just a little stand and your little phone sits in there. So, you can watch videos in it or it's, like, you're, you can rest your phone while it's charging. Whatever. After all this time of never seeing him in my store and seeing one that had a unicorn horn, it was a sign that Adrian needed to have it. Hopefully we get a new place soon. And it'll be a little something for her new room. Like, that's what I keep thinking. I'm like, okay, she has to have a new bedroom so she can have some new things in there, new scenery. So I got her that. Especially if I can find her the Dollar Tree, like, little bedroom decor things just to make her new room wherever we end up a little bit more special, then, you know, I'm all for it. So next in here are these makeup brushes it says um concealer brush and then that's some other language so there are these concealer brushes i picked up one for me and one for her so it's a unicorn horn you see how cute let me just take it out of the pouch like i can't ever buy like a makeup brush and not get one for her i can't do it i know she's seven but she totally loves makeup type stuff look how cute so it's silver like a rose gold, actually. Or rosy silver. And then the bristles. Look how cute. Focus on the brush now. So cute. Like I said, one for me, one for her. I'll just stick mine in there. I'll put hers over there with her little cell phone holder. Uh, next up I have... Okay, so I got a pack of these the other day. And they were like... Not the other day. The last time I was at Dollar Tree... I got some a while back and they were all black ink, which sucked because I wanted them to be colored ink. And then the next time I found them, um, they had these, but they were, I believe they were random colors because I don't think they had black, blue, red, and green. They had like pink, purple, orange. So just ballpoint pens, but the body of the pen is the color of the ink. Or maybe I'm just losing my mind and I did buy these. I think there's a piece of hair right here. Probably can pull my hair up to... I don't know. I feel like they didn't have red and green in it, though. They just had, like, pink. Who knows, people? Anyway, I got some ballpoint pens. With a tangent for some pens. Uh, next up, I've seen everybody and their brother haul these little pencil cases. Adri's going to be going back to school, so I picked up these two that I thought she might like. And these would be for at home, because at school, they have to have a 6x9 plastic pencil box. But for at home, for when she has homework, I picked up this. And so, so it's a... Blah, 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 blah. So it's a two pack. So this one has the one with ice cream, cheeseburger, soda. What did I just say? Soda. Pop. I'm in Ohio. Hot dogs, pizza, an ice cream bar. And then the second one in this little set is just purple and it's a little bit bigger, which she can use for whatever. 
So I don't know, whatever one she doesn't use, I'll use. So there's that one, and then there's this little set. So this set has rainbows and rain clouds and sunshine and sunglasses and umbrella, stars. And then the second, oh look, that one has a unicorn horn. <laughs> and then the second bag, the larger one, is yellow. So she can take her pick of which one she wants, which set she wants. And I will keep the other one. Next up in here, the a while ago when I went to Dollar Tree, I got a sign that says um, family, friends, and football. Like it's on a stake that goes in the yard. But then I was watching somebody's video. It might have been pretty important. I don't know. And they showed this one. It's like, oh, yes, we're huge football fans. So this says family, friends, football. And it has pumpkins and footballs. Yes. Preseason starting here anytime. How cute. I love that. So I got that. I swear, I go to Dollar Tree and look for stuff, and I come home, and I'm so excited and happy. And then I watch a Dollar Tree haul, and it's like, oh, my gosh, I have to go back. And then I see things that I didn't see the first time. Okay, I forget whose channel, but somebody was hauling this. Oh, my gosh, who was it? Because her dog, like, got was trying to get in the fireplace. She said he had pulled a log out before. Oh, I don't remember. Anyway, they had these. She had one of these little signs. I'm just going to take it out of the plastic. There are two different ones. They're little signs, but they actually like, would like sit on a ledge. And they're really thin cardboard, but they're so cute. They have a little uh, buffalo plaid. And this one says thankful. And it has the little pumpkins. I need to stop focusing on, you know, our situation. Just be thankful for what we have in our life. The people we have in our life. For my little kids. Which, obviously, I'm grateful and thankful for them anyway. But I need to not focus on the bad and just focus more on the good. So here's that. You can either hang it or it can just sit somewhere like on the mantle, on a counter, wherever. So I got that little sign. I also saw in somebody's video they had these cute little um, creative scenes. They're like stickers that go on these little scenes. I think they're removable stickers. So I, the my girls will love these. So I went to pick these up and they had four different ones. So I got this one, which is the haunted house. So it's like a little haunted house scene and you have a little ghost, like Frankenstein. You see the little stickers? There's like a witch. All these little stickers to like create different scenes. And this one is the graveyard. Look how cute these are. I've never seen these before at Dollar Tree. Never. I didn't think I was going to find them at mine either, but I did. I was like, oh my gosh, I looked through and yeah, I saw four different scenes. I don't know. If there's many, like any other scenes, let me know. This one is the pumpkin patch. Um, I hate summer. I'm not a summer person. You'll never hear me complain about fall or winter or the cold or the snow or the ice. I love it. But summer, I just, I don't do the heat. Like if I could just sit outside in a swimming pool all day every day and float around, it'd be great. But I do not like summer. So this one's potions and spells. So yeah, the pumpkins on these, I'm like, I'm ready. Fall and pumpkins and cooler weather and pumpkin apple um, candles from Bath and Body Works. And pumpkin cupcake candles from Bath and Body Works. Next up in here, I just saw this Disney addition and subtraction basic math facts problem solving review activities. Include your include your favorite Disney and Pixar characters. I got this for Adri. She loves math. She's trying to teach herself multiplication. She's going into the second grade. She's been trying to teach herself multiplication like all of last year. So it just has all kinds of different um, math problems in it. I should have got it earlier in the summer since they're about to start school here in like within the month. But that's okay. She she loves to learn. She loves to learn. She's trying to teach herself how to write in cursive. So yeah, she's going to love this. Oh no, I hope I didn't just wrinkle it. Also, Adrienne has a couple dry erase boards and then Alex wants them and then it's a huge fight. So I picked up two different ones for Alex. This is just a real flimsy, cheap one by Josh. I don't want to get her expensive one. She's two. So I got this cheap little um, one that's in a frame that's like has a cardboard backing. But then this one was even more sturdy. This is also by John. This is a dry erase board. It's bigger and it's like just this cardboard thing. See where this is like on the in this frame with cardboard backing. This is just a heavier piece of cardboard with a little decorative border. I don't know how well the ink will wipe off, but I mean she's two. So now she can have her own dry erase board. I don't want to break anything. And then in this next bag, there's quite a few things for just two bags. That was all just from one bag. 
Okay. And this, oh, Pretty and Flawed showed these. And I almost left the store. I'm like, no, wait, I want to look for those pictures. Like, I'll watch videos, like um, Dollar Tree hauls, and I'll screenshot things that I like. So look at these little pictures. This one says, Life is my favorite adventure. You see that? And it's gray and white. And it has sequins in it. It's full of sequins. They move all around. And it has a ribbon so you can hang it or you can just let it sit somewhere. I love this. Life is my favorite adventure. I was so happy I found that. There's like four or five. And then I got this one for Adri. It says, imagine, dream, believe. I never want her to think that she can't do anything or to never believe in herself. I want her to just have the biggest goals in life and just follow her dreams and believe in herself that she can do it. And you can. Like, where there's a will, there's a way. You need to believe in everything. Believe in yourself. Believe in the good instead of all the evil and hatred and nastiness in the world. So, yeah, I got that one for her. Like I said, just little things that she can put in her new room whenever, wherever we go. I also saw this. I thought this was a decent, um, a good deal. This is, says, inspired coloring patterns, coloring to relax and free your mind. This is a thick, like, adult coloring book. We have a couple, like, smaller ones. Oh, man, my stomach's a nut. But look at these. It says, featuring over 100 stunning designs, this remarkable coloring book is packed with dynamic, detailed, and satisfying patterns. So it's all these patterns that you just color in, all the different. Look how cool. So I might color in it. Adrian might color in it. We might all just color in it. Look how cool. So yeah, I picked that up. Uh-oh, I'm dropping stuff. Um, these last couple things. Um, Nicole Burgess, I was watching one of her videos and she had picked up, whoa, a box of these for Trey, her autistic son who goes to school, he, he doesn't speak, but she wanted to put these little note cards in his lunches that his teachers could read to him every day. I thought that was the sweetest thing for like any kid. So each box includes 18 notes and Adrian doesn't pack very often, but for days that she does, or I could just, you know, stick them in her, um, backpack. So one says you are the sweetest with candy on it. Here. One says, be brave, you got this. One says, have a fun day. And then there's three different designs that are blank. So there's these little cards that you would stick in their lunchbox or in their backpack. Look, with the monkey and the banana, have a fun day. This one with the lion says, be brave, you got this. How cute. If I was a kid and had one of these open my lunchbox or my backpack at school and had that, I would be so excited. This is one of the plain ones. Uh, this pink one says, you are the sweetest, with little candies. These were up by the register, so I grabbed two boxes. This one's a plain one with just stars on it. And here's another plain one. So there's those. Put those back in the box. Just a little something to let your kid know. My mom used to put like sticky notes on the bathroom mirror and stuff like that. Saying, you know, hug your dog, brush your teeth, like, especially on the first day of school. Don't, don't miss the bus and all that. So then also, like I said, to get little things for Adri for her room, I got this giant butterfly. It just says butterfly decoration. It's on a clip. I thought, like, in her new room we could hang, like, a butterfly somewhere. Clip it on her curtains or something. Just this really pretty sparkly butterfly with gems on it. Then they had these stickers that are 3D, or they're pop-up stickers. You can see, see the butterfly wings pop up out of there. So I got her some butterflies to go in her room. I have some wall decals that I had bought for Allie's room, and I never put them up, so I already have those for in her room wherever we go. And if we happen to find a place that has a bedroom for all kids, then I'll get some things for Jackson's room. Yeah, so I just got these little decorations for her room. Yeah, that's everything I picked up at this on this Dollar Tree uh, trip. So yeah, subscribe or not subscribe, so you don't miss out on any more Dollar Tree hauls. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you like these videos and as always I thank you so much for watching uh, Who's excited for football go Browns and yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys